Welcome to the video. The gang's all here. I'm using the iPad, so it is going to be a little bit different on the viewing. And um, it just is what it is. Basically, I'm going to leave it sitting there and I'm just going to pull this in because it's quite a different angle on the iPad. How's everybody doing? I didn't get to say last night, uh, it's Friday night, because I was tired. <laughs> I kind of have a sore throat today, so I don't know, being around all those people in tightly, tightly packed quarters for a couple days, I'm going to um, get back on my little immune, um, immune pills that, uh, it's like a dried mushroom thing. And it's worked. I did not miss a day of work last year. Immune, I forget what it's called. IMM, I think, something or another. So anyway, let's look at the rest of this box of brooches. The news is terrible, so we need something like jewelry. I'm not even going to discuss it. That's a pretty nice brooch. I mean, this is weird. I'm leaning all the way over the table. Um, very strange positioning on this camera. And my voice is a little bit like that. <clears throat> That's pretty. There's no name on it. I got my sleepy time tea. And um, Aunt Barry's you know, working on the, that's pretty. She's working on, oh, is there a name on that? Let me see what that name is, but. I've got the iPad all the way to minus and it's still super close like that. Oh, it says best. <clears throat> yes, best. Um, and that is pretty, though. I like it. It's not broken. That's a nice one. I ran air. I had to water. It took me about three hours today, off and on, with watering. And some of it I hand do because this is kind of unusual. Um, because I don't have San Augustine grass in very many places anymore, and I don't feel like mowing, mowing, mowing when I use the water, the sprinkler, it makes the, uh, the Bahia grass grow, and that stuff grows anyway. TC, it's cute. Another Christmas one, um, Loretta, you should be getting your package soon. Your little thank you package. That's broken, but that was a nice tree. So that's going to have to go. That would make a, something interesting. I don't know about a pendant, but it's very nice. So yeah, I was out there off and on dragging the hose and we haven't had rain in a while and we're not going to get any rain. But that's okay. Uh, for the front yard, I use the sprinkler, but then I have to spot water. That's a pretty pan. We have dahlias and everybody said they don't grow in the heat, but they're doing pretty good. A few of them bloomed last year. Um, my friend wanted to plant them, so that's what we did, or she did. She ordered them. So I, I 
hand water those. What is 900? Anyway, another straight pin. I like those. Put those in a group and sell them. Try to. I'm cleaning up the um, the prints and the two Japanese and then there's one that doesn't I can't read the name but somebody will know what it is that's this a pretty brooch there and uh, I'll be using this iPad to list them I gotta get them on tomorrow night and uh, they're going on this is pretty has a lot of black sparkly marcasite maybe or just rhinestone a pin rather than a brooch all right Sherman he's back there behind all his stuff isn't he well I went into the thrift store today just to kind of evaluate their jewelry situation and I am a little concerned because there's not any good silver or gold going on anymore. So I'm wondering what's up. Something's up. Another yellow ribbon, so that's two. That's really nice. Sherman, you're cleaning up again. Here he is. So what did I do? I, um, well, this one lady paints really good on the rocks and um, she tends to put hers out really early in the downtown area for the tourists, but really it's, she used to post that she was doing it, but some of the people on the rock group will run down and get them all and very hard for me to ever get one unless they decide they're going to re-hide one. It's the only way I've really gotten any. And um, that happened today. But this time she didn't even put on, that's pretty. Normally she takes a picture and she said, just put these out downtown. Well this time, she didn't even take a picture. Is there a maker's mark on there? I see Avon. Really nice and it's not missing any pearls. Before we're done, I washed the scarves. I just put them in the washing machine because I wanted them clean. That's cute. So I wash the scarves. And, um, and another one. I'll try to remember to show them to you. And we are, Aunt Barry is, going to bid on another AX. Is that like some kind of a fraternity? If anybody knows, let me know. She's going to bid on another group because uh, the best chance for me to get anything decent is, oh, I hope that rhinestone is at the bottom of the box. That's a pretty, pretty. is with these pins, brooches lot. So, um, oh, I noticed, oh, this is really lovely. Oh my gosh, Loretta, you would have loved this one. Uh, I think we're missing a stone there, but it's so pretty you can't even tell. I guess that's something else you could do if you're just doing it for yourself is to paint a color in there. 
no name and it's just lovely lovely um, forgot what I was talking about it's another lovely one That's pretty. It's just on a, this is like a piece of wood or something. It feels almost like that wood that you make a um, little airplanes out of, you know, little model kits when you were kids or whatever. That's a pretty, pretty little painting. Little Holstein cow. I guess this is to, if it's, you want to have it as a pendant, you can hang it like that. I don't see that it's missing anything. It's lovely. Lovely. I'm going to put this aside so I don't forget. Um, I don't know what I was saying. Must not have been that important. Joy pen and some earrings. Oh yeah, um, I remember. It's about this city that I had done well on and then you know how things are when something good starts happening. It just doesn't last long, things shift. Well, they changed things up and they had a bunch of just costume jewelry lots that were starting at $9.99 and nobody bid. Cause they were, you know, there's just a bunch of plastic necklaces. There was nothing there. That's cute. So they, several of them, I can't read that without the loop. I don't be able to read it with the loop. It's Jerry's, maybe? So, we're just going to wait and see what's going to happen, but... Um, you know, the old person, other person running it had a formula where they just threw it all in, called it fashion jewelry, and they, every now and then you get a gold or you get some silver for sure in every lot. That's pretty. And um, we'll see. I'm still waiting for one of these bugs to have whatever that name was I saw of like $2,000 for <clears throat> a bug brooch. I don't know the name or the mark or anything. So I thought that was kind of interesting that they had several lots that didn't go and several lots that just went at $9.99. So, people not buying what they're putting out there. And yeah, they've got their sterling all sorted out. Three or four or five lots of it. And it's going for about 70 something dollars for four or five little items. So maybe that's working for them. 
If that's what they're going to do, there's nothing I can do about it. But Aunt Barry's still keeping an eye on it. So I went into the thrift, that's right, and um, there's hardly any new gold put in there, and there's no silver hardly at all. Any chunky silver with stones has not come up all summer. So something's going on, but if somebody gets wind of it, somebody's going to jail unless it's the top dogs, but this hadn't been happening. So, made in Taiwan, I think it says. Ooh, pretty. Look at that. Sparkly, beautiful, very nice. That's cute. Wonder who made that. I don't see a maker's mark. Oh yeah, there is. It's just one of those little tiny S. Oh. S F J. I almost thought it was nine two five because it was like three let three numbers. Whatever. I can't make it out. There's a number underneath it as well. She's really cute and she's enameled. Trafari. Wow. That's a surprise. It looks like something broke off with those two. Let me see. It's damaged. Yep. Where those two spots are. Probably should have had a pearl or something on there. So Olivia and I went this morning, we found a few rocks. God's love is with you always, Camco. Oh, there's our spiritual message. Nice. The gang is having thoughts and prayers, sending thoughts and prayers to everyone, whether you're doing great and don't have any challenges right now or whether you do. The gang is always here. We'll have a spiritual message. Well, this is something in a baggie to keep the stones together. Doesn't look like it's sterling. I'm not sure what kind of stones those are. And I need some of that tea. Well, it's really pretty. It might be glass. I mean, look at this. It's like for the, to wear. And then it's like a pretty stone or glass or plastic. Well, I need to get that fixed, that's nice. Yeah, I think it's, um, 
That's man-made. It's pretty. We'll put it all back in here. It's a pretty one. Handmade with some buttons. Probably go in my button lot. Yeah, we did have one of these, so this is a pair now. I see it over there. That's lovely. I don't see a mark. Um, I dispensed of all of the items from yesterday that I'm not going to sell or attempt to sell. And I take it to the antique mall and put it next to the dumpster in big boxes. Tell what that says. There's several of them. Christians United for Israel. There's another one. Oh, and it looks different too. So we went, made two trips, and um, you know, if they were those really big prints in that painting that was slashed, um, they went, so they should be doing something with it. I can always tell if they don't like it because they'll just throw it in the dumpster, but Richelieu? Richelieu? I need to look that one up. Is that intact? That's really pretty. I will look that one up. Or You all are so amazing. Um, the research gang, my goodness. That has a name. I can't make it out. It's like worn down. It ends in ER. Everything else is worn down. Is this a brooch? Wow, it's huge. It's got, um, I think I've got it held the wrong way. Definitely looks vintage. Not broken. Another pretty rhinestone one, snowflake. I don't see a mark. Really pretty. That looks like it's got some age to it with the yellow yellow coloring. I don't see a mark. That's nice. I don't know anything about cameos, if they're plastic or, I know they're supposed to be made out of shell, but that one looks plastic. 
Yep, so there's, you know, no decent jewelry at the thrift. Um, stuff's piled on top of each other, Casey. The gold is not being refilled all summer. The silver is not being replanted. And they're getting a ton. I mean, summer is when everybody's dropping off their um, donations. Then today I went to the other thrift. Um, they close at two today. There's no name, but this cute. And um, <clears throat> I like nautical, don't y'all? It's very nice. I don't see a name on there. Wait a minute. They hung something like um the Virgin Mary. I get it kind of goes with it. So this is a religious one, I guess. That's strange. I wouldn't think that went with it, but the color matches. Lots of variety in these. Put those with the straight ones. Is that a cow or a horse? Well, that's hard to tell. That's like a rhino, I mean a hippo or something. I really don't know what that is. I cannot tell if that's a cow, a hippo, or a horse. I think it's a horse. There's a fan. That's interesting. I'm trying to find the mark if there is one. That is super cool. Yeah, I don't see a mark. That's a unique piece. They must really be looking at this because how is the Trifori the one that was kind of broken? Let's see what this says. Okay, y'all are going to have to help me here, too. Tarbo, Tarbo, number 9393. Tarbo. And let me see if it's missing anything. I don't think it's missing. That needs to be cleaned a little bit. It's really nice. That's pretty with those poinsettias. So downtown when I was looking at rocks, we got a little pearl if the pearl fell out. Um, I'm going to put all the repair things over here. I need to get a baggie. Then I saw the bicycle man with his painting and stuff strapped to his backpack. 
and I don't know, if he got a little money, I don't know. Don Lynn. But then again, I hope they don't give him any money so that way he'll go back to working in the chicken sheds of Louisiana for a hundred dollars a day. That'll go with my buttons. That's a homemade. I think this is broken. One of the petals. Billy Bob, Billy Bob, what do you think? That looked like it had potential. That's neat looking. Not a pendant, people. The brooch. these are they've been cut off of something the pearls are not real here's this tree again and I think this time it's intact. Yay. It's pretty. I like that one. So these are all different design. Somebody's gonna want that, right? I can't remember what it was I needed. Oh.
you go, Sherman. Avon. This looks like it's missing a bunch, so I'm gonna make another little craft bag. That's pretty. Small, simple with a white melt glass. We have a couple of little bits in here, but I don't think it's gonna fix this one brooch. But I just lost one because there's a little hole in the box. Okay. There's just gonna be a few little things here, but it's not gonna fix this one. We're going to start getting a little baggy of stuff. And I uh, wanted to show you all the scarves. I think I'm going to try tomorrow to get them on along with these. Oh, let's have our spiritual reading first. I'm not going to be able to put it up there. For this child, I prayed for this child when doctor said he would never be. I prayed for this child with each tiny movement as I waited for his birth. I prayed for this child the first time I held him when I watched his first steps. I prayed for this child through let mama kiss it well to his first broken heart. I prayed for this child that his heart would know the young woman God sent to be his wife. I prayed for this child and shed tears of joy watching him hold his sons. I still pray for this child with a heart full of thanksgiving, knowing that he's God's child too. And then the quote is, First Samuel, I prayed for this child and the Lord has granted me what I asked of him. So we're going to go this way, see if this works. It's, uh, it's not light enough, but lots of different colors, thin ones I think that you just put over your head. So that's the scarves. Thank y'all for joining us. We'll see y'all next time.